Hi, I'm uh, Mr Hill and I'm Head of uh, Biology at Clisvale Community College. Um, it's been fantastic to teach this incredibly interesting and varied course for many years here at the school. The course itself uh, is split into six different modules. Uh, the modules build on the work that's been done at GCSE. If I take you through the, the modules that we study, the first one is all about um, cells and biological molecules. Um, the second one is about the breathing system and the circulatory system in humans. And then we look at transport in plants. Then we move on to our third module, which is biodiversity and evolution. The fourth module takes you through homeostasis. And the final module at the end of the two years is all about genetics and evolution. There is a sixth module uh, that's really about uh, practical work. Each of our students has to carry out 12 core practicals. Uh, the core practicals, although not counting towards the exam, are examined in the final papers at uh, the end of the other uh, course. Um, pupils that want to study biology uh, need to have a grade six, either in biology or in science, double award science. And as well as that, they're gonna need to have a level six uh, when it comes to, uh, to maths, because at, in year two, there is a big maths component. Uh, we have to use statistics uh, to quite a high level on the course as well. Um, biology is a fantastic subject to combine with lots of uh, other A-levels. Uh, for example, it goes really well with chemistry. It goes fantastically well with maths and also psychology. But lots of students um, just have it as a standalone going with art subjects as well. Um, in terms of the students that we've had here and what they've gone on to, uh, to study at university, uh, a huge number of them have gone on to study biomedical sciences, biochemistry. We've had a lot of uh, medics that have uh, gone on to university. Uh, we've also had lots of physiotherapists, opticians. Um, so it really is quite a key foundation subject. Um, if you've got any further questions that you would like to ask me about the subject, then please don't hesitate to contact me.